Like a message in a bottle on the rolling tide, Sea of Thieves sweeps onto the shores of 2017 full of mystery and promise. All the new features of update 0.1.1 mean that players picked for our next playtest face the dangers of an expanded world and a skeletal uprising as they venture far across the open sea. Back in December, we let 1,000 lucky insiders roam free in our first update, and since then, that pool of players has only grown. As we've pushed back the boundaries of our world, you and your fellow rascals will now find many more places to plunder. How many more? Nobody knows. Well, we do. But there's no point in spoiling it, is there? Within this indeterminately larger world, players will discover new islands presenting new challenges and opportunities. One might come with a hidden cove to anchor in safety while you shovel up loot. Another might let you perform a daring getaway after grabbing another crew's gold. Just look before you leap, as fall damage is now definitely a thing. More islands also mean more outposts, increasing your options for hustling chests safely back to the shipwright. This should make it easier to avoid the ganking that some of you feared during our first update, which is how the cool kids refer to treasure-related blunderbuss incidents. While you're off adventuring, make sure you don't let your guard down, not with the rattling remains of long-forgotten pirates prowling the islands. They may be gutless in strictly biological terms, but these old skellywags will still come right at you with rusty guns blazing, so your crew members need to watch each other's backs. So that's our latest update. There's still so much more to come, but for now, we hope you can join us to search and skirmish your merry way through the new, wider world of Sea of Thieves. Cheers!